Yeah. Today, folks, is a very special day. On this day in 1938, Superman. So, folks, we love comics. We love to talk about this stuff. Obviously, we have Wokebusters is dealing solo, but Superman is in production right now. It's going to be out in 2025. We have a new Superman. We have a new Lois. We have a new universe, and we have a new director, James Gunn. And so over on social media today, James Gunn released an image of him, Superman's actor, and... Uh, Lois Lane's actor, I forgot their names, and they're all reading Superman comics, getting people excited uh, to celebrate Superman. So I just want to ask you guys a little, you know, since we're in the spirit of Superman, the first superhero and a superhero we all enjoy, are you ready to give this movie a chance or are you just turned off from DC as a brand since Zack Snyder? I'm, I'm not turned off from the brand. I mean, it's, that's one of the, the disadvantages of being you know, a hardcore fan of that type of media, man, being a, a comic book fan, you, you know, particularly characters that you like, you know, you kind of get bamboozled or honey dicked into watching movies and other properties based on them. So don't get me wrong. I ain't going to watch another Zack Snyder project unless I have a gun to my head. Uh, or specifically <laughs> be like, Hey, you may get to talk to him face to face where you can just give him a barrage of what the fucks. Other than that, I ain't watching anything. But when it comes to Superman, you know, I'm 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 always open. I'm a lot. <laughs> the last few years we've been we've been hurt, so you know it, it definitely leads credence to being cautiously optimistic about certain uh, Superman projects oh, yeah. and waiting to see if it's good or not. But yeah, I mean, I'm you know, I'm not turning off the brand that bad that yet. I'm not as disgruntled as I was a few years ago as a Lions fan with Superman. I'll say that for now. <laughs> So it's maybe uh, look at look where the lions went. So all you got to do is believe exactly. it a little longer. Superman could be back in the conversation, baby. You know, you never know. Henry How Cavill, feel, though? I'm sorry they fucked you over. That'll be the first good Superman film in our lifetimes, because uh, none of us were born for uh, Superman too. That's that's true. That's true. But I mean, I do I do hold Christopher Reeves. You know, like he's 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 the best. He's 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 the one I remember. He's the one I grew up with. So. That's he really I, is. I, I like a lot, you know, even, yeah, even, even when he had his accent, I felt, I felt terrible and it was, it was horrible to see him struggle to, with that whole thing. Um, but yeah, even, I don't know. The one, the, the one off Superman movie we got was really weird and I didn't really care for that too much. Superman Returns? Yeah. Yeah. It just didn't really go the anywhere. Dean Cain one? No, no, not, no, not, not Ralph. Oh, yeah, Brandon man. Ralph, that's the one. Yeah, I didn't really care for that one too much. It was okay. Um, Henry Cavill's one was really good. It was, it was, you know, well, it wasn't really good. It was okay. He Sorry. was good. He was good. Yeah, he, he, was good. was good. he was good. The movie was 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 very meh. But uh I don't know. I I feel like I feel like they're trying to get Batman and Superman to to uh you know to be their to be their top tier um properties that can really milk them even more so than anything else for all they're worth so we'll see how this goes but i just don't i'm I'm just not a fan of them constantly rebooting these these superheroes over and over again with different people different stories like and shit like that like i'm even with batman we have so many iterations of it now it's impossible to keep up with and if, oh, it if is we, like yeah and if and if we as, as we as comic book fans and fans of, of the of the comic book genre can't keep up with that stuff how are normies going to even understand it you know that's 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 where the real money is oh yeah because you know we can go get excited but we're not going to go see like eight we're not going to buy eight tickets like a family like two families might so it's like you do have to appeal to them i'm not saying that you cast the fans aside though folks uh but yeah no i agree with your assessment of man of steel henry cavill's good but that movie I'm still pissed he broke a dude's neck. Like, why wouldn't you just, like, fly into space and, you know, throw him or something like Superman always does? He finds a way. When Superman doesn't have an answer, all shit's lost. So, uh, Kendo, your opinion, sir. Uh, look, I'm ready for a good Superman movie. You guys know how much I love Superman and Superman 2. Not so much everything that's come after that. I, I don't hate Dean Cain as Superman as much as Nick apparently does. And then... <laughs> You know, I, I, yeah, the, the only reason why Man of Steel even was serviceable was because of Henry Cavill being so good. And then when we expected the Justice League to shit the bed and it, you know, just skid mark the bed, it, you know, Henry Cavill being in it was one of the better parts of the movie, having him in there as Superman. So I don't know. I, I just looked up the new, the guy that's playing Superman, never seen him anything. So I couldn't tell you anything about him. 
Same thing with Lois Lane. Don't know her at all. Um, at least she has a Wikipedia picture. Superman don't. But at the same time, James Gunn has given us good superhero comic movies. So we at least, I would say that instead of being cautiously optimistic, like I normally am with a lot of this stuff, I'm actually just optimistic because I feel like maybe it'll be in good hands because it's a filmmaker that, you know, tends to do well with the material he's given. So like, you know, he did good with the ones he's done, but at the same time, if it turns out to suck, well, then it's just one of those par for the course at this point type of situations, you know? So I feel like we could better hedge on this one. <laughs> Wait, is that going to be our new thing? If we think it's going to be good or not, we'll bet our hedge on it? Yeah, we'll just bet our hedge on it. On. All right, like, we're optimistic, on. but there's always a chance it could suck because of the fact that most superhero movies in the last – shit, it's probably more than five years because, I mean, Endgame was okay – but even before that, like some of the last MCU movies weren't all that good leading up to it. So it's like, what are you going to do? It's Let's true. hope it's good. Uh, hey, I'm I'm on board. It's expensive as shit to make. So, And people think, why would you care about the profits of the box office of a movie? Because we all like Superman to some degree. Uh, he's oh, yeah. like everybody's superhero. Like, okay. We all grew up in the era where he was still most people's first superhero. Like it's it was ubiquitous. It was Superman or Batman, and then the Marvel characters. And then as we got slightly older, it was just Marvel. Marvel kind of dominated that '90s window. But anyway, my point is, I'm very optimistic about this because yeah, Warner Brothers realizes this is it for a while because you can do too much brand damage, and then you have to take a break, and they can't afford to take said break. So. I believe they know that their feet are up on the against the fire, and that is why that they will find a way to make this one perform, and we will get this very appealing version of Superman, which will probably just be classic Superman. I know a lot of people really like the man over on uh, the Superman Lois show, was it Taylor Hecklin or Hawkland? So he's kind of popular. Superman has more positivity behind him than he has in a long time. I'd say the last 10 years has done a lot of good for Superman over saying, you know, you may not like the Snyderverse like we do, or we don't, but Superman's like, I guess was a Q rating, they would say back in the day, has stayed pretty consistent. And he's been in the public's eye a lot more than he has like in the early 2000s. Superman did go away from for 19 years from the movie theaters. And he definitely felt like after Lois and Clark ended, he was just kind of relegated to the backseat for like 10 years. So well, I'm yeah, he still too. remains extremely popular. Yeah, well. He's like the superhero superhero. Everybody knows Superman and can relate to him because I don't mean this as a dig, but he's generic enough to be like have a broad enough appeal. That's kind of where he lives. So okay. uh, I got to get more. Do I have to get Dion? Should I get more Superman stuff for the shelf or is like a Christopher Reeve figure in a 90s uh, animated series figure enough? You probably need to get some more. Okay. Yeah, just, that. just, 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 just a few more. Just a few more. Actually, um, is there a Zod? Get a Zod. Oh, yeah, Zod would be good. Yeah. Or okay. Amol Muzz. Get Amol Muzz too. <laughs> so, anything else you guys want to say about Superman? I'm interested to see where Batman comes into this, but I'll save that for another time. I, I just hope, like, I, I just hope we're not getting an origin story again. I don't want this. I don't want to see his his parents. The 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 farm this bullshit like i'm i'm done with that like you're going to, you're going to you're going to see the farm because they just cast jonathan kent yesterday oh we don't need that it's the same thing with batman we don't need to see the wings get shot in the alley no yeah, hold we, on though it <clears throat> there's a lot of superman where his parents aren't dead like in comic books and on lois and clark his parents are alive so that's could be no, a no, situation no, that's... where they're just like he's current day superman and he'll fly back to see him because that's see, that's okay though I mean, yeah, if he's, yeah, if he's, yeah, if, he, if he's, if he, you know, if you save some broad and then he's, you know, flying, flying, flying home, you know, he can go get, he can go get the milk, you know, for, for mom, whatever. That's fine. That's fine. But like, don't make it, don't make it the thing where like, you know, the, we, we see crypt, we, we see Krypton, the, 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 the thing with the baby and all this other stuff. Like, no, 